If performance art is all about making an impression, Henry Doctor is hoping to make a dent. As deep as the entrance to the DuPont Circle Metro Station. Make something fun and make something wonderful. This is the place where Doctor tried, spreading some color in a sea of stone, planting flowers in these boxes. There also are a lot of neglected spots, and those are the ones where I have this little voice in my head which says, this is a job for the phantom planter. But Washington's transit agency did not take kindly to the gorilla gardener, booting the blooms, ripping them out. You can, you can do whatever you want to my flowers, but you can't do whatever you want to my brain. And I'm going to make something beautiful out of the destruction of the flowers. All of it driving Doctor to film. Where have all the flowers gone? Long time passing. Four and a half minutes looped for almost two hours Sunday night on this sliver of parkland. His audience had friends. He's created this fabulous piece of work to show Metro what's really important in life and people just passing by. Not too sure about the film. I think he should be able to plant the flowers. You know, this is our community. For its part, Metro says it worried about safety on these slopes. From a Metro spokesman, a simple statement, no trespassing. Metro kill them everyone. But not everyone. Those are the daffodils that started it all. Some of the daffodils that Metro missed, showing some life. Yet on this spring night, no burst of blooms, no riot of color to brighten a commuter's way. Just the Metro florist. This is good people singing their hearts out. The phantom planter, performing his art. But wishing his real masterpiece had found roots, steps away. I'm not sure why I do it. I might be a little crazy.